<laughs> I know I've said it before, but if you don't know me, a little bit about me, like the beach is my, I've had therapy, I'm in therapy. I, I, I work on myself truly as much as I can. Nothing gets my mind right more than the beach. Being on the ocean, just the healthiest thing in the world for me, especially when I can be with my dogs. And even more so to take it a step further, when I could be on the beach with dogs and it's their first time, you know, this is their first time and to see them, just every dog just loves the ocean. I think every dog does, just, they just love it. It's such a pure, beautiful place. You know, such a natural, beautiful place that feeds your soul. And uh, look at this. Athena has been a couple times, not many, but two or three times, but it's all their first time. And it, I think part of the therapy for me, part of the therapy for me is when I was younger, we only lived a couple miles from the ocean. We lived a couple miles from the beach. And that's really where I used to go to really think and to be. That's where I discovered I like to be alone. That's when I felt I was better alone. I was more creative alone. Um, you know, now I have someone special in my life. It's not about not wanting someone or everyone needs someone, if you will, right? There's nothing more beautiful or powerful than love. But of course you have to love yourself first and you have to find yourself first. And you have to, to love yourself, you really have to know yourself and accept yourself. And the, the, the beach is a really a big part of the process to help me do that, um, if that makes sense. But yeah, growing up, I just, it was a lot of fighting and it, it was, it just, I was just, I felt better alone, you know? Hey, let's go guys, let's go. felt better alone and uh, when I'm here when I'm back at the ocean um, it, it always brings me back to my childhood so many memories I had so many memories I have growing up from being at the ocean with just one dog you know thinking about my future think really like manifesting envisioning wanting all of it so it's special to be able to be here with these dogs it's also special to be able to make this video with you. I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that have their happy place, you know, whether it be the mountains, the desert, just at home, anywhere you are, home makes you feel safe. For me, for me it's the ocean. Now I'm watching them carefully because in Oregon, hey, come on, in Oregon we have something called uh, sneaker waves. Sneaker waves or sleeper waves, some type of wave that can just come and take, you know, just a quick wave. A lot of people die that way. And of course, animals, not on my watch. It's not the type of tide where you see it, but still, you wanna be cautious of it, especially with a dog like Stella. But it's ne never too late for a rescue mission, you know? I have to go for a little swim to rescue a little Shih Tzu. That's what daddy's gonna do, baby. <laughs> Come on, Matilda. Come on, Matilda. Come on, Matilda. Come on, Matilda. Come on. Come on, Matilda. Come on, Matilda. Come on, Matilda. Matilda, let's go. Matilda! Come on, Matilda!
Good timing. Okay, guys. I love you. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope you have a beautiful day. Bye.